港點解 underground music 永遠都好似 underground 上唔到誒，唔、uh, 係 underground 上唔到歌叫咩？入唔到屋。係啦。啊。咧，我係覺得，因為只要你一多啲人識嘅時候咧，啲人就會將你鬧翻落嚟㗎啦。咁所以我哋應該永遠都會係 underground 嘅樂隊，<笑>只要你一啱啱好似多少少人識，又會將你鬧翻落嚟。咁我哋繼續繼續誒、呃、loop 呢個 loop OK 嘅 ，enjoy 嘅。唔同即係唔係主流嘅音樂咧，就俾人稱稱為 underground 啊，或者好 indie。咁其實誒依、這個依、這個情況喺香港，我覺得係。即係特別嚴重嘅，即係俾人 label 咗玩 band， 甚至乎玩 band 都會俾人 label 咗係一啲古靈精怪嘅事情。咁其實我相信係好大程度上係因為即係香港、呃、普遍嘅聽眾或者香港人即係個接受程度接受音樂或者個音樂教育方面都真係比較落後嘅。我覺得、呃、即係有時譬如、呃、有啲樂隊玩啲、呃、可能胡嘈少少或者、呃特別少少啦，都唔可以講話嘈啲嘢咁。其實佢哋即係已經好多時，即係完全唔會去接觸咯。即係聽到呢啲會，即係哎呀唔啱我聽啊！即係即係會起咗好多個牆去保護自己咯。I have a theory, I have a theory about it. It's just that、um, it seems like music in Hong Kong, the established music,、um, it just seems to not really、um, incorporate a lot of the local music, a lot of the local talent, and、um, I think it's kind of engineered that way, and it's it's really a shame because people should have more to say about where they live. And yeah, there are people, of course, that are trying to contribute their voices to it, but yeah, it just seems like there's not much of a market for it just yet. It's all、uh, kind of to the periphery of the the canto pop and the, the stadium shows and Aaron Kwok and I don't know the guy, but yeah, just it seems like that's kind of getting the lion's share of the attention. So. Yeah, everyone else has to kind of do it for their own reasons. 即係因為你個比例上，即係其實好多人夾 band 都會睇埋數噶嘛。即係其實表演者就係嗰個 audience。咁其實所以比例上，即係個地方細，所以容納到容納唔到咁多音樂。其實近年啦，都好興翻國內出數。咁我哋發覺，誒，去國內出數咧，有誒個感覺好唔同。咁其實可能頭先都回應翻阿霞講個問題，因為。市場好好大啊，成個市場好大啊，咁你可能好一一部分人聽聽誒、嗯、聽呢類型音樂咧，已經你覺得哇觀眾好似好多，同你香港哇可能一小撮人啦、啊，咁你搞 show 咁有啲人可能唔知邊度邊度搞 show 嘅喎，咁但係你喺國內就誒、哎、我哋覺得好大個分別，咁我諗同真係個地方即係區域性問題咧都有都有啲關係咯，咁香港始終都係誒即係人同你其他國家比可能真係好少。即係現實環境，可能佢係一個比較細嘅地方。咁媒體咧又唔係好多種。咁、嗯、我覺得每,每一樣嘅文化其實除咗即係人玩之外，亦都要有人報道噶嘛。咁、嗯、我覺得媒體係唔夠多同埋唔夠精。嗯啊、即係可能係、呃、你可能單睇、呃呃呃、我諗最易明嘅就係頒獎典禮咁樣，音樂嘅頒獎典禮，即係冇冇分音樂類型嘅獎啦，誒、呃、冇樂隊獎啦，咁誒、呃，我諗呢啲係媒體嘅嘅嘅嘅嘅責任咯。咁當然啦，即係我哋玩嘅，即係可能我哋玩嘅一班一班玩音樂嘅人，其實就唔係好 care 呢啲嘢嘅。咁但係我會覺得近呢。幾年都進步咗好多咯，我會覺得，即係、呃、平台會開放咗啦，咁同埋亦都多翻少少嘅報導嘅。Uh, why hasn't like the underground scene developed more in Hong Kong? I think it's because like the culture here, or、well, there's one major aspect of the culture here which is like super finance driven. Um, so I think like arts, the arts and、uh, music aren't as respected. As they would be in other countries,、um, so I think that's why it's a little bit harder for the underground scene to develop. But it has, it has seriously like Im improved or developed so much in the last like ten years thanks to、um, people from like the underground.、Uh, But why do you think it's specific to Hong Kong though? Like, I don't know. Like the rest of Southeast Asia, like. In my opinion, is doing better than Hong Kong. I just Singapore is doing really well. Just because, like, just because, like, I think it's the there's a demand for it. You know, like, 
in Hong Kong, it's you know, it's just everything like supply and demand. Like in Hong Kong, we don't have that demand for like for rock music, you know. And I feel like the the general public feel that if anything's like not major sounding and like has like a crash hit that's not on like the end of the song, then it's like too. It's already like metal and rock, you know. Like oh, people indie. can't. It's like black and white for people at the moment. They can't hear the shades of grey within the music, you know. Uh, underground the music, of course, you have to be underground. If you're not underground, it's not cool. If you can hear it, what's cool? Maybe when I was young, I was a pop star or a Hong Kong artist. I think the music is like that. Maybe it's not just our generation, it's our generation. 誒爹哋媽咪或者再老一輩，佢哋可能已經係有咁嘅咁嘅模式嘅時候，咁成個社會都係跟住呢、這個呢、這個模式走，就覺得啊呢、這個先係一個正常嘅嘢。而 underground 或者 rock 係一啲 alternative 或者偏門嘅，咁自自然俾人 label 咗嘅時候，自自然嗰個 market 亦都會偏重咗喺一邊啦。即係我我覺得係咁咯。可能對比起外國，我覺唔係嘅，我覺就係話 rock and roll 係 mainstream 嘅，其實都係好正常嘅嘢嚟。即係可能佢哋啲爹哋媽咪全部都聽 rock and roll 大，咁佢咪覺得嗰件事係係正常正常嘅嘢就會係個 market 就會就會去投資或者去誒、呃、去參與多啲㗎啦。咁而香港個可能就係呢個音樂文化由細到大嗰個 trend 嘅影響，我覺得就可能係因為咁嘅原因。我覺得係最簡單直接就係因為關於嗰個政府嘅問題咯，最終關事咯，我覺得。因為你都唔去推呢個文化，即係、嗯、即係你見到其實就算係喺條共產社會主義出現啦，佢都唔俾你發展落去啦，下晚都係反政府嘢嚟嘅，簡單啲，同埋好多都係，佢都唔會俾你話吹水，成個所有人都有會洗曬腦咁樣